My name is Matt Dalfwaite. I'm from the Centre for Bioinspired Technology at Imperial College London, and I'm here to talk about my work on an NFC-based uh, batteryless CMOS ISFET array for real-time measurement of pH in biofluids. So the application we're working on is for wearable chemical sensing. And this is important for basically taking real-time, non-invasive measurements of physiology for sports science and healthcare. In when you, normally when you take uh, kind of chemical measurements of, of physiology, you take blood tests, which are invasive, not very comfortable, and also uh, you can't take them continuously. So we aim to use other biofluids, such as sweat, to take measurements of uh, the, the physiology of the body uh, in real time and more, more easily accessible. The challenge we're aiming to tackle with this demonstration is how to power such devices. If you uh, batteries in, introduce unwanted cost and unwanted uh, size, so it's better to come up with an alternative solution, especially if your sensing devices are, uh, need to be low cost and disposable because the lifetime of chemical sensors is quite short. So the innovation that we've gotten for here is developing a very low power C CMOS microchip uh, containing chemical sensors, which are iron sensitive transistors known as ISFETs. The, these sensors uh, are part of the microchip and all fully integrated in the device. And the whole chip consumes less than 10 microwatts. As a result, we're able to power the device through uh, energy harvesting sources. And in this case, we're demonstrating uh, wireless powering through NFC. So the, uh, so the demonstration uh, is, is a kind of uh, benchtop setup of the, uh, of the idea, the principle. So we have our uh, chemically sensitive ASIC on the uh, top here, uh, underneath a flow cell, which allows us to place a pH solution onto the sensing surface to represent uh, sweat. As, as you uh, exercise and, uh, and you begin to sweat, and become dehydrated, the pH of your sweat changes. So sensing pH is a, is a nice introduction to uh, looking at uh, uh, the properties of sweat on the body. So the, uh, the ASIC is housed on a development uh, platform uh, for purely for testing purposes. Uh, and it is connected to a commercial NFC uh, harvesting board uh, from Silicon Craft. Now, uh, the, the, the harvesting board contains a, a coil, which allows us to uh, take uh, harvest energy from uh, a standard smartphone, uh, which, which uses uh, an NFC uh, principle, which is uh, the same, same uh, method as contactless payments, and it's in um, a lot of uh, m many smartphones. So the, uh, the phone provides power. It's regulated down to the uh, a stable 1.2 uh, supply for the uh, microchip. And the microchip uh, detects the pH. and on board converts it into a frequency. So we have a pH to frequency converter on the, the microcontroller. And this allows us to get a, a nice, uh, simple analog to digital conversion for detection. The phone also provide, provides enough power to uh, can power a microcontroller, which then measures the frequency for us. And for the purposes of this demonstration, displays it on a, a LCD screen. But in future, it could be to, uh, expanded to show, show on an app. So uh, for the demonstration, I uh, currently have a pH solution of pH 7 applied, and then I will apply a lower pH to the, uh, to the surface of the chip uh, using this flow cell. And we'll see a change on the LCD screen. We'll see a change in uh, frequency. Um, so ultimately, the, the next step for this work would be to bring this into a flexible patch, which can be worn on the body. We then have a, a we, you can then imagine a modality where somebody is exercising or uh, being generally monitored, and you can tap your phone to this patch and get an instantaneous uh, analysis of pH, or in future, other metabolites, uh, ions or metabolites, such as sodium, potassium, perhaps glucose and lactate, if the sensing sensors were expanded. But there's also the modality of a wearable smartphone holder, which people often wear on their wrists, well, they, uh, to power a patch continuously and get continuous and real-time information uh, of physiology as somebody exercises. Uh, thank you.